New COVID-19 infections are hitting young patients. A 22-year-old man in Pensacola is sharing his story, hoping more people his age take the illness seriously. WKRG News 5's Chad Petrie has his story. While Troy Hart is nowhere near death's door, at least for a little while, he felt like he could have headed that way. It can happen to anybody, and it's not fun, and you don't want to deal with it. Hart shared his COVID-19 journey online over the weekend, saying he was diagnosed in early June and his symptoms kept getting progressively worse, from a high fever to shortness of breath. When I fall asleep, am I, you know, am I not going to catch my breath? Am I going to like pass out? Am I not going to wake up? It got so bad he says he sought treatment at Sacred Heart Hospital in Pensacola. His story of COVID survival has been shared hundreds of times. He was eager to tell his story, but he also says he's been harassed by some people online who claim that he's either exaggerating it or making it up. You know, I'm not trying to fear monger. I'm not trying to scare anybody. I'm just trying to say you're not invincible from being affected by this. And when you do get it, it's not a fun road. Yes, I survived, but it was a long road. It took me 20 days. He says he hopes other people his age realize COVID-19 is no joke. Chad Petrie, WKRG News 5.